Hi guys, today I have part two of my Jewel Scent ring collection. I have 37 rings here and I kind of have them separated by price and then I have some that I don't have the tags for so I'm not sure how much those are praised for. Sometimes they fall off or I wear them so I take them off. So I'm gonna pull these back a little bit so that the camera doesn't focus on the rings in the background. But this first set here that I'm going to show you have the code PP36. These are $40 rings. I'm just going to show each one real briefly just so you can kind of get an idea of what kind of rings you'll get if you order Jewel Scent products. I get a lot of questions about which one's my favorite, which one has the best rings, which one has the best candles and products. Jewel Scent is definitely in my top three companies. I've actually probably been using them longer than I have any other company. The first company I ever um, did ring reveals from was Diamond Candles. These ones are SG46, so these are $20 rings. And I started not liking the jewelry in Diamond Candles, and that's when I found Jewel Scent. And all their jewelry is very shiny and sparkly, and you get all different colored gemstones. So I really like them. And of course, I like their products as well. They're really starting to expand their products, change up how they do things, so I can appreciate that. This one is SG39. This is a $48 ring. I really like the black and white stones on this one. Very pretty. Then we have PP20. These are $22 rings. This is SG24. These are all $15 rings, which is the minimum that you would find. They do have some unique rings in their products sometimes. And no, I have never had a problem with them tarnishing or turning my fingers green. I get asked that a lot as well. I think they're pretty good quality for being costume jewelry. These are RR150, so these are $24 rings. I do have pretty many $25, $24 rings. And with a lot of the companies, you know, they say you can win something $1,000 or $10,000. They have all these um, options to win when putting in a code. With JewelScent, they put tokens in their products if you've won something over $100. And I actually have known people and have seen it come out of a candle. So I know that they exist. With some of these other companies, you know, they could say that all they want. But do they really give out stuff that's expensive? Because no one would really know if they didn't. I like this ring a lot. It's really pretty. And this is the last one in the RR150 group. The next and last set I'm going to show you do not have the tags for. This one didn't have the code on it. The last few products I've done from them they put the coat on the bag instead of the ring. So if you take it out of the bag, then you don't know how much it's worth if you try to keep them together like I do. I try to sort all mine since I have so many. I have them divided by companies. Fragrant Jewels and Jewel Scent are the most popular ones, I guess, that I do. But I do have pretty many from Charmed Aroma, Pearl Bath Bombs, and some of the others. So once I have a decent amount of those, I'll probably do a ring collection for those companies in case you guys are interested. Probably do one for Scented Treasures as well. They're quickly becoming one of my top brands.
pretty light green stone. Very dark blue one. The purple ones like this are some of my favorite. Very pretty. And I have just a few more. And some of my favorite products from them are actually their body scrub. It lathers really good, so it's good for shaving. And it smells so good. And of course, their candles and their tarts are good. And they've now just recently expanded it so you can actually get necklaces and earrings instead of just rings. So again, they're changing things up, adding on to what they do trying to keep up with some of the other companies. And the last ring. So that is my 37 total rings from Jewelson. If you guys like these kind of videos, please give the video a like so that I know and I will keep posting them. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.